Good morning, you guys. Happy Monday. I am tired already. I'm in the middle of deep cleaning. I just got done working out. Yes, working out. And can y'all hear that? I don't know if you can or if you can't, but my water baby, y'all, I have neglected him. I need to clean his home and get him together. His filter is making that noise because I need to clean it. So I'm going to do that. Um, I want to scrub the floors and stuff. I like to do that when I'm here by myself. But um, yeah, today is really just a cleaning day for me. Once I dropped the kids off, I came home. I washed all the laundry last night. So I folded everything, washed bedding, put that on the beds last night as well. And I just want to um, sweep, scrub the floors. The bathroom is clean. And then I also need to get a shower once I'm done. But I'm going to... Um, I need to work on current science fair. Well, that sounds crazy. I'm not working on his science fair project, but it is some stuff that I want to print out for him because I want it to look really good. Put the pictures on like photo paper. And yeah, so this morning is like a great morning. I am mentally like so well and I'm just going to enjoy today. I was like, you know what? Let me come on here. And go ahead and start my video off because if you guys don't know your girl is being consistent with these videos even though i'm not doing vlogmas i still just want to add a few more videos during the week i hope you guys are enjoying them if there's anything that you want to see if there's a certain day or time that you would like me to upload that's more convenient for you let me know in the comments and i'll make sure to do that i'm gonna go ahead finish cleaning i just wanted to come and say good morning y'all have a beautiful amazing marvelous and blessed monday and let me get to it from school 
Y'all, I got a bath and when I say, no, a shower. And when I say, I uh, am, um, can y'all see my eyes? I'm so sleepy. <clears throat> but I went ahead and got dressed for the day at 12 o'clock. Um, I'm as bare as bare as can be. I actually like, I really love my skin. It's just, I don't know. I love my makeup too, but I don't know if y'all can see that. Ken just asked me, he was like, girl, what did you do to your face? But I ran out of my Clinique um, facial soap and I used something else that I had. And y'all know that I have sensitive skin and apparently it, I would literally be dramatic if I said that it broke my skin out. It didn't, but I have like just a little bump right there. But um, yeah, we're going to just do a little chit chat really quick. I, um, I cleaned up y'all. Oh my gosh. The house smells so amazing. Um, the wax melt that I showed y'all was, I think, snickerdoodle cream something. When we got that one, well, when we purchased that one yesterday, I did not like it. Ken, um, I asked him, I was like, hey, you know, pick one out because I'm always picking them and I don't know which smell that I want. And what I do for the fall, I love Christmas scent. So literally all of mine will smell the same. So he picked that one out and it was like in the store, I didn't like it. But once we got home, oh my gosh, they like, it smells so good. It is strong. I um had it downstairs, like under the TV and then went upstairs in the shower and I can smell it like coming under the door, but I love it. Like it smells so good. Um, But yeah, that had the house like oh my gosh it took it to a whole nother level even though it was already clean but also my food y'all so delicious like um that's another thing that i try to do <clears throat> i try to well me and ken both of us try to go like meatless sometimes um and when we do have meat it's always on the grill we do fry it from time to time only because my kids like fried foods and i want them to have a variety but um, we're going to get back in the groove of doing our salmon like we used to always do. But I decided just to do like a, a nice size baked potato and then put broccoli in it. And it was just cheese, butter, a little bit of sour cream. And I just seasoned it really well. Oh my gosh. Y'all, that thing was so good. But um, I'm about to be here at their school. And then did y'all see those cute cookies? so cute ken actually stopped by the house because he was out delivering um those cookies to all of his new clients i guess that's something that they do so he um brought some home and i just told y'all the other day that we are gonna give the kids something small up until christmas every day so that is what they'll be getting today but I'm about to get them. I'll get Kenrick a little bit later once track practice is over with. And then um, me and Ken will go back out once we've gotten them home and baths and everything and go ahead and get the Christmas gift that we need. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this vlog. Um, I don't know when I'm going to be uploading this week. It'll either be it's either gonna be thursday or sunday one of the two but yeah today's been an amazing day um just want to end this video with some words of encouragement i was just talking to my husband about that that it's like what i'm learning is to just enjoy every day but also i'm a person that thinks a lot um I'm big on like a schedule, a routine, but what God has been showing me is that now that he's revealing to me <clears throat> my true self, because I've been praying for that, I also have to remember to take it, take everything just like a day at a time. Like even something small is like what I have to do during the week. I want to learn to be disciplined and consistent and just focusing on at this point, just worry about today. Don't worry about tomorrow because when you do that, you become overwhelmed and you also feel like that you haven't accomplished whatever it is you were trying to do. So 
and um you know also just like i was telling my husband because we do that a lot but learn to just give yourself grace like um we are the type where you know we can uplift people we can be there for them in any way we can and then it's like after that's all said and done we don't even give ourselves grace it's a lot of things god gets us to do behind the scenes or whatever and we don't feel worthy of it but at the end of the day it's like we're just on to the next thing we don't celebrate ourselves or anything and i was like you know what i have to learn to do that because guess what when you're doing stuff for god and you're doing stuff for the kingdom he's not getting you to do that in vain and what you have to do is even if you don't feel worthy of something that you did you still have to remember to celebrate yourself and that is what i'm going to do starting the last month in this year and moving forward i'm gonna i'm going to work on and learn to give myself grace if no one else celebrates me celebrate myself and just continue to love me because the more i am working towards finding out who i truly am in christ the more i am trying to be more loving and kind and in god's image and in his likeness the more i slow down with my situation and everything that's going on around me the more peace and joy i'm gonna have the more i'm gonna love life and not the things that i have but just my life in general so i'm not even gonna start y'all because i can go all day about that but yeah i'm at the kids school i'm about 10 minutes early so i'm just gonna sit here and chill out <clears throat> i will like i said have um not this video but i'll be uploading another video for you guys on either um i don't know it's gonna be sometime the end of the week so thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe and i will most definitely be seeing you guys in the next one bye